Love it. There you go. <laughs> Vending heads. What's up, vending heads? All right, so we're on the way to drop off our spiral gumball machine. I didn't tell a lot of you guys, but I've had that in storage for a few months now. I just wasn't looking for locations for it. But it's a, it's 628 right now. It's a little dark with the whole daylight savings and stuff like that. But, um, but yeah, we have this uh, sports bar and grill. My friend, he manages this place right here where we're going to drop off a spiral gumball machine. He told me to bring it in. I know it's a little late, but hey, he told me to bring it around this time. That's what we're doing right now. So I got Jamie here with me and let's go place it. Yep. Oh, and one other thing guys, like the way I do things, like as far as I have an appointment to go drop this thing off, I'm not going to walk in there with the machine. I'm going to walk in there, ask for him, find him, and then maybe get an idea of where he wants me to put it. The reason why I'm going to do that is because what if he's busy? You know, if he tells me where to put it, he can go back to work and I can continue to just place it, put the gumballs in it and whatnot. But yeah, so let's go inside and let's go look for Matt. All right, so we're walking over there. And on top of that, guys, he also told me to bring in an honor box. We'll see how that goes for us. Um, I don't like putting honor boxes on, on my friend's place of work because I feel like they, they feel responsible if there is stuff. And I don't like putting that that on them, so. Hello, oh, we're looking for me. What's up, Mr. Matt? I'm from the YouTube. The YouTube, right? Yes, sir. You're from the YouTube too, right? You're welcome. Welcome to my restaurant. From the YouTube. Over here. Nice. That feels like a good spot, huh? Yeah. What do you guys think, guys? Damage a gumball. Is that a good spot? Oh. Hey, what's up guys? I would like to give a big shout out to Vimmy. Now she is a fellow vendor and she has amazing content over on her channel. So please do me a favor and go give her a follow and let her know that we sent you. Now after we finished placing this gumball machine, the next day Matt gave me a phone call and let me know that the investor said they wanted me to fill out some kind of liability form. Pretty much saying that whatever is to come of the spiral gumball machine that I, that I would take full liability for it. Now this is something I have never done before, so uh, this is where Vimi came through. She reached out to me, let me know that she's a paralegal. She made this form for me, it looked legit. I took it to the investors and they were happy with it. And here we are. All right, man. Well, thanks a lot, bro. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, dude. Always, always. Just feel free to move it, feel, you know, put it wherever you need to. I can move it to like my bedroom. Hey, wherever, <laughs> wherever you want it, bro. Awesome. I'm not gonna say no to you. No, I'm excited, thank you. Yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your face. Ah. There you go. I hope it's a purple one. It is. Hey! 
Is it purple? No, it's red. Hey, what's up, Vending Heads? It's November 1st today, and we're doing a Day of the Dead event over here. Say hi. Are you warm, Mama? Look at those cute gloves. 